loves, bonjour, ma buhai, and welcome back to my channel. So, we are almost in springtime, and I think this is the right time and right moment to give you my first impression on the latest item that I have purchased from Cezanne. And that item is none other than the Justine basket bag. So, if you're interested to know what my thoughts are, just stay tuned. Hey loves, welcome back. So like I have mentioned at the beginning of the video, I am going to do a quick first impression of my Justine basket bag. But before that, I want to let you know that I made an unboxing video of this handbag. I'm going to put the card just right there as well as a link in the description down below. Feel free to check it out so you have an idea how the handbag was packaged as I have ordered it online. So after that, I'm just going to show you how the handbag looks like and then the specs of the handbag and then I'm going to share with you what I think about the handbag, why I purchased this handbag, why this size, why this color and at the end I'm going to put some mud shots uh, to show you how I think I'm going to use this handbag or at least pair it with my outfit for spring and summer. Okay, so I'm just going to show you first how the basket bag looks like. So this is how the Justine basket bag looks like in the front, on the side, the back, the other side. That's how the bottoms look like. And then the inside. I'm going to open it. There you go. So as for the specs of the handbag itself, so first and foremost, the Justine handbag are were actually made in one of Cezanne's atelier in Madagascar. And as you can see in here, it has a hand woven raffia exterior. And then um, this basket bag can actually be carried in different ways. First and foremost, it can be handheld or on the crook of your arms, as well as um, a shoulder bag, as you can see, because it has this long shoulder strap. Um, the length of the um, handles for the this handle it is 15 centimeter and then for the um, for the shoulder strap it's 28 centimeters. So just to let you know as of the handle and the shoulder strap they are not adjustable um, and then the inside just to show you it has this cotton lining in here i'm just going to take off the dust bag i actually this is the dust bag that came it came from and i generally put this inside the handbag so that it will keep its shape and that's how i store my handbag to be honest so yeah so the inside looks like that so it has a cotton lining which is actually attached i think that's a good thing because um i can put things inside and they can be you know secured because you can uh, close it with leather ties so it will really be fully secured and then the weight of the bag without anything on it is actually a uh, point uh, 47 kilograms as for the dimension it is um 25 by 51 by 18 so yeah so that those were the specs of the Justine basket bag. So now I'm going to give you my first impression as well as my thoughts about the handbag itself and also concerning the delivery and the packaging. So I'm going to start off with the delivery. So just to mention, I have actually purchased the handbag on the day that it was relaunched this 2024 and it was a Sunday. So I have purchased the handbag on a Sunday and it arrived here in Belgium from France around the mid of the week. So around Wednesday or Thursday. So it was really quite fast. It was actually delivered through DHL Express without any custom fees because it's within European countries and um, without any shipping and handling fees as well because I think I have surpassed the um, threshold, the minimum threshold to have a uh, free shipping. So as for the delivery, 
perfect, very fast. As for the packaging though, I don't know if you have seen the um, unboxing video, the uh, packaging, to be honest, I was a little bit, you know, meh, <laughs> because in comparison to the other packaging when I have ordered, you know, previous ordered from Cezanne, I think previously they packaged the items quite well unlike this time you know the handbag was just inside the dust bag and it was just put in the bag and then that was it so it seems like they haven't put much you know effort or heart into packaging the item but anyways other than that it was still you know it was okay the handbag wasn't damaged or there are no defects so it was okay it was let's say the minimum required for the packaging was okay so yeah so that was my um you know the impression that i got from when i opened the package um and then as for my thoughts on the handbag itself so i'm just going to show you first the handbag again so yeah firstly i have opted for the medium size justin basket bag this handbag actually exists in three um, different sizes you have the mini basket you have the medium basket and you have the large which is really a tote bag um, tote basket I you know I opted for the medium one for different reasons first and foremost the medium one I will be able to put everything that I need in this bag because I have a lot of, of space as a new mom it will be easier for me also to put you know my son's stuff inside so yeah that's the first reason the second reason is its price tag so the medium one costs 220 euros and then the mini one is if i'm not mistaken 190 euros and the biggest the large one is 320 so price wise with the size this is the best combo um, especially that with this one i can wear it as a handheld i can put it on the crook of my arm and i can also wear it as a shoulder bag because the mini one it's very cute the only thing though is that i can only wear it as a handheld or a crossbody um, bag and then the large one i think it's the same as the medium one but with my frame as i'm a petite person i think that that will be too large for me especially as a basket bag so this was the best combo you know size wise and price wise so that was the second reason why i have opted for the medium one and then the third reason also why i have opted for this specific handbag actually this color wave i got it in the natural raffia it does exist in different colors on uh, Cezanne website you can check it out but i have opted for this color because first and foremost i think light color for spring and summer is great so yeah that's why i opted for that and then the second reason is this color combo i think it is a lot easier to wear with different outfits and it's very neutral so it will really suit every outfit that i have so yeah so that's why i have opted for this size and then this color combo to be honest i also have another basket bag which is the loeve um, medium basket bag and it's also in this same color combo so even though i already have that uh, color combo i still opted for the same for the Cezanne. i think it's for the same reason it's just that it's a lot easier to wear uh, use this kind of color combo handbag for a basket bag and also if you're interested i will do a another video a comparison between the the Cezanne basket bag as well as the Loewe basket bag so if you're interested um, for that just stay tuned i'm going to upload that video so if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet feel free to subscribe and click the notification bell so that you won't miss any of my future video and i'm also going to do a basket bag collection video i'm going to share with you the different um, basket bags that i have so those were actually the reason why i have opted for this 
handbag this size and this color combo so my first impression of the handbag itself to be honest i am very satisfied of how it looks like i'm very happy of the size as well the raffia how it was made i think it's really perfect and then the inside also um that's what i liked about this one is that it has this inner pocket that is attached and that i can also close so very protected for that reason uh, that i have um, purchased this to be honest uh, i saw this last year but it was already sold out so i was like last year i told myself that if ever this handbag is going to be relaunched again i will definitely pick it up as soon as it comes out which was the case so yeah so i also love the you know the um, this leather part here with the logo which is very subtle i like it like that and that's what i like about Cezanne also and then the bottom part it's yeah i can say anything else but very happy of how the handbag um, is presented how it looks like so yeah so those were my first impressions as well as my thoughts about the handbag the shipping as well as the packaging so now i'm just going to show you some mod shots of how or with what i am actually going to pair this handbag i'm going to show you some spring outfits as well as some summer outfits so enjoy <laughs> So that was my first impression on the Justine basket bag. If you have any questions or requests, feel free to leave them in the comment section down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, please free to give it a big thumbs up as it will really help the algorithms of my channel. And like I mentioned earlier, if you are enjoying the content of my channel but aren't subscribed yet, feel free to click that subscribe button as well as the notification bell that way you won't miss any of my future video so up until then i wish you all a um, pleasant day or a pleasant evening and see you soon take care bye